Another artwork from the Tenke Fungurumu mine in the Katanga, a sight which never fails to amaze me. Um, sitting on a young Dolomite matrix, we have this vaggy, uh, or a vag filler almost, of Krasakala. Now, I want to show you what's happened with the color here. This is actually a, a pale blue to a, almost a turquoisey color. Uh, appears pretty white on my still pictures, but when you look at, I think when you zoom into the still pictures and look at the cross sections of the Krasakala sitting of course on the matrix, you'll see it's a powdery white and then intersected with a, a almost a, a waxy, waxy blue, which would be also Krasakala, blue to turquoise, and then this has all been dusted by a layer of druzy quartz, giving it that fine undertone of the, the blue to turquoise color. From a display point of view, if you have it lying flat on a turntable, this is the effect you'd have. A little bit of projection of the crystallization of the main ore. Looking at the back, not much happening on the matrix side, and looking from the top down, I quite enjoy this angle. I display it at this angle, for instance. And look at those, and that dusting over there, those tiny crystals, maybe some malachite, maybe some heterogenite, or for sake of ease, we're going to say malachite. Most likely not malachite, but uh, for sake of ease, malachite is always easier. Yeah, as time goes by, I always say if we add another element to the periodic table, a lot of our IDs will probably. <laughs> It's rather confusing.